Well, speaking of battles on the hardwood, but moving along to the CAAC White, come Friday, the Ionia and Lansing Catholic boys will tip off for the league lead since both are currently tied at top of the white with identical 7 in 1 records. It should be quite a rematch, and we'll let our Nick Mantis take it from here. Last time these two teams met, it all came down to free throws. Lansing Catholic's Alex Waters missed both shots in a three point game, and Ionia was victorious. Friday night, the Bulldogs and Cougars meet again. Ionia Bulldogs are, are really well coached, um, and when you have a guard like Szymanski, anything's possible. Schaefer cleans up a lot of things at the rim, so their big little combo is really tough for us. They got a lot of different guys that can score. Uh, I think they're a real balanced team, so any of their players can have big nights. Uh, we got a lot of respect for their basketball team. They play the right way. They play hard. One of the biggest differences between the last meeting and this one is obvious. Lansing Catholic has the home court advantage and on senior night. But what adjustments have the two teams made in order to be prepared for Friday night? The court's small. We can't go out there and let them control the pace. We got to have our point guard, Trevor, control how we play our game. Just go out there and perform how we have been the past 11 games that we've won. Kind of just controlling the pace of the game, honestly. Like everybody moving, everybody open shots, kind of build up the chemistry. So if I drive one way, I know that person's going to be open on the opposite side. The game plans are set. On Friday night, a champion will be crowned. Nick Mantis, Six Sports.